Hey there Minecraft commanders and welcome back to another video of this channel. Today I'm finally here with a new one command creation because this one is a masterpiece guys. It took me almost a week to, to cut it all out uh, but I'm finally here with Wacamole in vanilla Minecraft. So I think we can get started by giving ourselves a command block. You do it by typing in the chat slash give at p command underscore block. Hit enter on your keyboard, place the command block, copy and paste the command from my website and then come with control V then uh, always active and then done and boom. Uh, one thing uh, is that you get the uh, item straight away, y you won't have to click anything. This was because I didn't manage to, you know, um, make a click event and insert uh, this item here. So the way it works is really simple. You just have to right click and there you go. <laughs> There's the Wacamole. Uh, okay, as you can see here we have the moles. You have to, I suggest you to memorize the position of them because they will disappear as you as soon as you right click this sign. Right guys, so as you can see straight away we get this awesome writing which doesn't use any resource back. May I remind you, there is only the default one. And as you can see it looks really really good. Um, tell me in the comments if someone can actually guess how we did that without using any resource packs. Uh, look at it carefully and maybe you'll figure it out. I think it looks pretty pretty awesome. And the fact that it doesn't use any resource packs is... Eh, I like it, I like it. Okay, so you have to right click in order to start playing. So let's do this. Okay, so the game has started and in order to work them all, we just have to punch it. So we will be given points based on how many of these moles we can hit. So as you can see, based on how many moles appear, uh, points will be given and one mole gives, a, gives me uh, 10 points, two moles will give me um, 25 points and as you can see three moles will get me 40 points of course uh, the more moles there are at once the um, the more time they will the more time they will stay out so it's actually uh, more difficult to catch the single one so as you can see we finished we got a title with our score and as you can see my score which is my last score was 440 this was a pretty bad match because I had to talk while playing because this game requires a lot of attention and now I'm just going to play and, and play some music in the background so I can concentrate on the match and you can see guys that um, if you concentrate you'll be able to win this game or, or at least get one of the highest scores. Okay guys, see you later. Okay, the game's over, now I got 890 points. I've also missed um, 
a lot of, uh, you know, the three moles at once. If you whack all of them, you'll get 40 points, which is quite a lot. Uh, of course, this is a game you can play with uh, someone else. You can challenge uh, your friends to who gets an highest, the highest score. As you can see, the score while you're playing is visible right here on the action bar. And while you, you watch some moles, you will see the points that you're given uh, right when you walk them. I believe the highest score you can get is around uh, a thousand points or maybe some more. All the moles that come out are completely random so uh, there's no defined pattern uh, in which they appear. It's just all random so if you get lucky you'll get different moles which are easier to catch and if you're not you get like one here and one on the other side. If you get two of them really close it's a lot easier. This game has many features. All of the game mechanics are randomized. There's a score counter. Uh, you get different different points for uh, different numbers of moles you hit. For example, by hitting one mole, when only one mole comes out, you will get 10 points. But if two moles come out and you just hit one of them, um, you will be given only five points. That's because the more moles come out, the more time you have to hit them. So the game is really balanced um, in that manner and it works uh, in multiplayer as well. I'd really like to see this machine in some servers. I think it fits uh, a server perfectly if you want to have fun with your friends. This command should also be compatible for uh, Minecraft 1.11, so it's backwards to compatible. Uh, even though this was designed in Minecraft uh, 1.12. So as you can see, uh, even if there are two Wokamoles arcade machines, this is still working. The match ends after you, let's say, see, not hit, but just see, 100 moles. This includes when there are three at once and just so. So that the score can be balanced with all players because they play uh, with the same amount of moles. This command was a really masterpiece because it includes a lot of calculations, uh, all the game mechanics. So guys, that was it about this command, I hope you enjoyed it, I loved creating this one because, you know, it turned out to be pretty amazing. Um, the next video will be a vlog, so stay tuned for that and stay tuned for my next one command and commands creation. Bye guys!